Hey guys, what's up? It's Jimena. Welcome or welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you've been here before or actually if you haven't been here before then definitely click on that subscribe button it is great i am pretty sure we're gonna have lots of fun these next couple of days because of this whole coronavirus pandemic but um today and the next couple of like videos are most likely gonna be home videos and i'm gonna set you guys up on my tripod right now because i do want to like address like my channel and sort of like the future videos that i'm going to be posting because of this like corona pandemic and so basically i am going to my family and i are trying to stay indoors uh because of this whole coronavirus the state of california has called for a state of emergency although the city where i live in which is la <laughs> is um hasn't called state of emergency and i know that because schools haven't closed there's a school like really close to my house and they're still having classes um that's how i know our city is not necessarily in a state of emergency but you know that could happen in the next couple of days so i want to let you know that most of my videos for the next like month or so are going to be more like in home videos just because i don't want to be going out and risking my safety or my family's safety i know that corona the coronavirus has is affecting like a lot of people especially a lot of businesses it has affected me like firsthand because i am a postmates courier driver which means that i like it's like uber i take deliveries on my phone and i can pick them up from a restaurant or if they order from like a clothing store or wherever and deliver it to their house and that involves a lot of um interacting with lots of people and especially here in la such a big city we have surrounding cities around la which sometimes i go to those surrounding cities so it is something that is gonna affect myself and my family economically um but i really hope that you guys love watching these videos and right now youtube is basically gonna be my uh main source of income for this month even though i don't earn like a lot um it is gonna be you know my source of income so there are gonna be some ads throughout the videos but i'm not gonna like drawing you guys in ads i hope you guys stay safe please remember to wash your hands as much as possible my hands are so dry now but i need to um, moisturize them but yeah wash your hands cover your face i mean like cover your face if you go out don't touch your face if your hands are dirty you know basic health procedures and yeah i hope you guys enjoy this video and the next couple videos i'm sorry it was really long i just wanted to explain that a little bit but yeah let's just get on with my day okay first crisis of the day um we have been dealing with like leaks from my bedroom window there's like two holes up here i'm gonna try not to show my whole window but um i don't want you guys to find out where i live but here like the whole like the holes are dropping in water whenever it rains especially when it rains really really hard and so like when the water hits it splashes and that's why we have this whole rag situation i even have the freaking mop and bucket here because one night when we woke up the water was like right here and it literally hit my bed and it wet the bottom of my bed um basically the what's it called the the bed board i am going to leave now because my sister needs to be at school even though she has a minimum day and it's already 10 o'clock in the morning so um she's gonna be quite late but <clears throat> i am wearing this um top it's kind of like it has like a stain on it i'm sorry but it's from urban outfitters from the men's section they have the best like t-shirts or whatever and then this like fluffy jacket which is my favorite favorite but it's also from urban okay guys we just dropped off my sister at school and we did her enrollment for the next school year so um it's been a while it is now 9 36 i am in the car with chris mochi and my mom's in the back mochi's in her little like baggy right there i think we're gonna go to starbucks because we haven't had food and driving back home is a little far i mean it's not far but with this rain it's just not advisable to drive home we're not even in la like where we actually live we're in like another city around the la area so um yeah i think we're gonna go to starbucks i know i said we're not gonna go out 
But we haven't had breakfast, or at least I didn't. Did you have breakfast? No. Ma, ¿tú, tú desayunaste? No. No. None of us had breakfast, so we're going to go out and, I mean, we're going to drive through Starbucks. So, let's go. Change of plans. We are going to be going to Coffee Bean instead of Starbucks, because my mom wants Coffee Bean and not Starbucks. So, I mean, I love Starbucks. But Coffee Bean's hot chocolate is amazing. I'm just going to put that out there but their bagels and their pastries not as good as Starbucks we're at coffee bean right now I got a small hot chocolate with whipped cream can you open this for me I can't do it with one hand. Chris, what did you get? Green tea. Green tea? Chris loves green tea. Do you love the green tea um, or the matcha frappe, right, at Starbucks? Hmm? Try it. See if it's good or not. I love hot chocolate. It's like milk chocolate. It's really creamy, but the one at Starbucks is just like no. Chris and I got a bagel to share. We got an everything bagel. And then um, my mom, I got her a plain bagel right here. And then I also got her a small um, coffee, regular coffee. And then we're gonna fill it up with some milk. So usually coffee bean is super full at this time. It is um, 10.06 a.m. And it's pretty empty. Like. If you ask me, they don't have a lot of people because of this coronavirus. Hey guys, what's up? It is a lot later, but we went to pick up my sister. We had some food and now Chris is here. Say hi. Well, he's been here, but um, I'm going to be just doing things around the house, like picking it up and um, washing some dishes, doing some laundry. Right now, Chris went to help me check if um the laundry machines are open and available to use but um yeah we've got the laundry separated i am going to be um putting in laundry because i am literally out of clothes so i think i am going to go and wash with the machines right now oh i need to get the soap um yeah with this coronavirus thing it's honestly kind of scary apparently i'm gonna put you guys up here apparently with this coronavirus um i don't know if it's true or not but they're saying that uh like the, the actual virus and germs and bacteria stay on your clothes for about i think they said five to ten hours and they said that on services it stays for like 12 hours i mean um, yeah 12 plus hours um, so I am about to put all of my clothes to wash. Um, if you guys are interested, this is the soap that I use. Don't like using the softener, like little sheets. What are those called? Like drying sheets. I like to use like an actual liquid softener and I'm using the Ensueño Max Fabric Softener. It's Ensueño. Ensueño. No man, you, can't, you, you have to pronounce this properly in Spanish, but Sweno. it smells so good. So um, the machines at my house actually have like a reader or scanner that I can use to pay from my phone, which is really cool. Scan the machine. I let the water run for a little bit and I put the soap and then all the pads, the pods, sorry. Set a timer for 27 minutes. Okay, 27 minutes and counting. So I just want to show you guys what the kitchen currently is looking like. I am about to tackle this small kitchen. I love it, honestly. It's small, but I love it. 
Um, I'm gonna put dishes in the dishwasher. We already have a couple in there. Well, only two, but I'm sorry you guys have to see that. I'll try to blur it out. But I have to put all of these dishes in the dishwasher to get ready to wash. I don't even think we'll put the dishwasher to like wash yet because we don't have enough dishes. But I will start putting them in there. And then I want to show you guys my pantries because I actually fixed those yesterday. But we stocked up on some uh, non-perishable food enough for like um, two weeks. Because apparently you're only supposed to have for two weeks. And yeah, we will tackle the rest of the house later. But first, we're going to do this section. So I have 20 minutes from here until I have to get the laundry out of the washer and put it in the dryer. So I'm going to try to do as much as I can right now. <music> To do after I basically have like rinsed the dishes before they go into the dishwasher I did I say before or after after I have done that I like to get some vinegar this is uh, vinegar and water mixed together it's a great alternative if you don't want to use like bleach or any like harsh chemicals and it does like a really great job as well so um, I am going to spray this It's honestly vinegar it's it smells like really bad but i honestly would prefer it over bleach any day because it's bleach is just really bad for you to smell but this works great to clean literally any surface that you have and then my mom also puts uh dish soap here and vinegar together and i like to spray some of that as well very little because i already put vinegar and then with this little brush I just like to like wipe this down. I used to use a lot of like bleach and other like harmful like um like liquids to clean here before, but now we've been trying to be a little more conscious about that for the environment and then just like also for our own health. Now I'm not saying we don't use bleach to clean stuff or just like bleach at all we do we just try to reduce the usage of bleach in our household and it's turned out great you know and also our surfaces here we like to disinfect it same thing with some vinegar and a spray bottle i think the spray bottle is from the dollar store honestly this is very affordable and vinegar i don't know or you could get it maybe you can get it at the dollar store but most like stores have that so so the dishwasher has been loaded with all of the dishes that were in the sink so i'm just gonna oops put this away for now now i'm gonna try to tackle the counter let's see how much time we still have in our thing we have five minutes so hopefully i can tackle that before the five minutes are up and i have to go back to the laundry Unfortunately, I have failed. I kind of finished wiping this down. I still haven't uh, wiped down this part of the countertop, but my um, laundry is done washing, so I am going to put it in the dryer now. And don't you love this lighting? I actually had to bring out my um, studio lights because um, 
it's just way too dark in here okay guys so it's been i looked at my wrist to see the time but i don't have my watch on um anyways i cleaned the kitchen or at least i finished kind of cleaning you know all of the surfaces and stuff i still have to um like vacuum and mop but I think I'll do that towards the end when I'm done with the living room and the dining room. But honestly, this kitchen is going to get dirty really fast again because my mom called me and she told me that um, she wanted me to take out the fish, um, the tilapia fil fillets from the freezer so that we can make some and have some for dinner tonight. And I'm using this bag. This is just the Super King Market brand um yeah it's just tilapia fillets i already put them in water right here and this water is already freezing i have to change it like every 30 minutes so that these they're pretty like good they're still in their individual packets which is great so um yeah i'm gonna do that my clothes is almost done drying i put in a new washer and a new dryer but i couldn't really vlog it because there was someone else there at the laundry room so she wanted to use a laundry machine so i couldn't really like do a lot or like take forever but this counter is clean as well and i just have like the trash bags and a bag for recycle because i just decided to separate it and then these dishes i washed but they are like drying on this like drying towel because i don't have a drying rack and these we don't put them in the dishwasher so that is what i'm doing right now i'm gonna tackle the dining room area right now chris is sleeping on the chairs he's very tired this coronavirus has just affected him tremendously life is postponed for right now but i'm gonna tackle this and i'm gonna do a timer lapse again pretty good they're starting to like come back little by little but that's not the point i just finished um doing my laundry and my sister's laundry my parents did laundry during the week so thankfully i didn't have to do more than that but i literally spent like two hours doing laundry um or th like three i think but it is now what time is it it is 6 33 p.m it's really late but i have gotten the kitchen and the living room and the dining room really clean but this is the dining room it's clean i just have to mop that's the last thing i need to do the living room is pretty clean as well so yeah i just i already vacuumed i just need a mop i'm gonna make food right now i am gonna make deep fried fish i think i hope that's how you say it but i'm gonna tie up my hair for this like half up half down okay we've got the breaded chick uh, what's the chick just like uh fish i want some chicken i'm crazy that's why i decided to fry them okay this is on high we're gonna put it on two
what's up it is the next day i completely forgot to close out this video so i'm just gonna vlog like a tiny bit more just so i can like wrap this up yesterday after i finished cooking we picked up my mom ate it is the next day and it is the weekend and there's literally no one outside the streets are empty we're passing by like this this place called the americana it's kind of like the grove if you're here from if you're from la then you know what i'm talking about it's like a mall like a fancy mall but there's no one out and by this time now even if it were raining people would be out i mean there's people out but just not as many people but i still need to go to target to stock up on um some makeup like round pads and um so we already ordered ordered we already ordered that through the target drive through app because right now target is just really crazy so we just rather order it through the app and then whenever it's ready we'll just drive through it and it's like less contact with people i guess in some sort of way so we're just gonna wait in the car um and we ran some errands earlier today i'm here with chris Say hi. Hi. Are at Target now. We're in the parking lot because all of the drive throughs are taken. I want to show you guys. All of the drive throughs right there are all taken. And this car is not moving. Uh, the other side is. The other side's free? Yeah. Oh, careful, careful, careful. Ay, that car crazy drivers on the road oh he's waiting for the drive through as well look at him damn we got a drive through spot but the parking lot is crazy there are so many people inside of target it is crazy let's go Pinoy boy our target drive up order um can't show you the barcode or else you'll i don't know but yeah it's right there but we are waiting you got the barcode on your phone oh yeah sorry thank you you guys have a nice day thank you too we we got it fam we got it Chris wants hand sanitizer because he. The lady had gloves though, so. Still, you can't trust nobody. You ain't taking no chances. Well, you have to disinfect this then. You're gonna touch this again. I basically a haul? got. Seriously? Oh, uh, Target More like a haul. purchase. <laughs> Target haul one item. Um, I got the Target brand, the Up and Up basic cut and round pads and there is three packs and each of the packs have a hundred so i bought one for okay, my mom one for my sister and one for myself so hopefully we are stocked up for um the rest of this pandemic because this thing is kind of scary but we've got the <laughs> we've got the cutting pads um and now we're gonna go home so that was it for today's video guys i am sorry i'm ending it a different day chris is here eating but let me know what other videos you guys would like to see this month because definitely i'm definitely going to be home most of the time since we're pretty much quarantined or deciding to self-quarantine at home so let me know and don't forget to subscribe and i will see you guys on my next video so casual